I left Woden at the door of his panic room. By talking of fate, Vlad had been asking for my blessing to his plan to murder me. I've been keeping to the backbeat, reacting to Vlad's moves, cleaning up after him. No more. It started. Get in there. Quick. It started. <laughs> All right. Hey, turn it this way so we can see. <laughs> Buzz off. The Adventures of Captain Baseball Bat Boy, Episode 167. <laughs> Maxwell's demon has taken Bicycle Helmet Girl to his secret mothership, hidden behind the moon. To save her, Captain Baseball Bat Boy must brave the cold void filled with demons' nefarious minds. Bases loaded. Fastball! <laughs> I can't stop thinking about Gagnetti. Has he gotten the boss's gift already? Tick, 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 kaboom! <laughs> it's going to blow his head. Grand slam! Once more, Captain Baseball Bat Boy has escaped Demon's trap. But can he save Bicycle Helmet Girl before Maxwell's Demon turns the world into a dreaded closed system? A Hollywood franchise that goes perpetually on forever? Go! Find out in the next episode of the Adventures of Captain <laughs> yeah. Baseball Bat Boy. Captain Baseball Bat Boy rules. Hey, you! You! We're closed. Go away, cop. The boss is not here. Without his search warrant, you've got no business being here. I had to get through the building to Vlad's office. See if he was there. You heard me? Get the hell out of here, cop. <laughs> Remember me, Shatter? It's Mike. Guess I'm an outlaw after all, huh? Like Billy the Kid. Everybody, get ready. Get your guns. Get him. Where did he go? I don't see him. He's gotta be close. Stay sharp. He's gotta be close. I don't see him. Where is he? Anything? No, but we'll see him when he steps through the door, and he'll see us ambush his ass and shoot him dead. Did you hear something? No, and you better shut up so he won't hear us. I think I should go take a look. No! <laughs> shoot! <laughs> Get 
he here yet? What? Can't hear you. Here. He's near? Keep your hands on your ears. It's gonna be a loud bang. What? Hey, you! Cleaning company vans, the cleaner jumpsuits, the illegal firearms, the hard evidence that proved Vlad was behind it all. And now, Lords and Ladies continues. My Lord! I have slain my brother. All is lost. I am a Lord no more. Men, capture them. Your word is our command, my lady. Mama? Yes, good, good. My precious boy, a noble lord is dead. A vile crime against our illustrious name. A crime that shall not go unpunished. My lord! Unhand her, you brutes! Yes, good, good. Men, let her go. Aye, my lady. Good. Good, my dear girl. You seem faint. Do sit down. Rest. Here, a glass of wine. Drink. It will bring color back to your cheeks. Thank you, my lady. No! Do not drink, my lady. Valentine. My lord. Allow me. Mama, I drink to the memory of my brother. My lady. I drink for you. No, my son, that is not for you. Uh, men, stop him. Too late. I have swallowed the bitter poison. I am dead so that my lady can live. With this deed, I prove myself a lord. My lord? No! Fire! Fire is loose! My lord! My lady! Go! Run! Live! Mama, you are no lady. No, no, my son, no! Aha! Come on, 
I'm waiting. Let's finish this. You can't hide. What's taking you so long, Sheriff? Scared? Vlad and Mona were on a crash course. If I'd find one, the odds were I'd find the other. Vlad was after Vinny. He had left me a map to follow. You have one new message. Vlad, it's me. Where are you? I need you. I'm on my way to the construction site now. Winterson. I'll do it. I'll take care of them both for you. I don't know. Is this a crime? Is it against the law to be happy? They haven't seen you with my boy. Haven't seen you with me. Miss you. Call me. The gilding on the mask had cracked to reveal the rot underneath. Winterson's confession didn't wash away my guilt. It made me feel worse. I had a meeting scheduled with Vlad at Vinny's place. <laughs> 